I've been competing internationally for 20 years. This is going to be my last shot, but my preparation's been a little bit different to most. Always up for a challenge. Ah, I've come to join them too. He's fantastic. He's here to inspire hundreds of local kids to get active. I just came to say hello. Hello. Limpet, limpet. And he needs little introduction. So tell me about street athletics. Uh, what street athletics is all about really is just to be, we're just trying to engage and disengage kids through sport. It's not every day that you get one of Britain's best gymnasts coming into your school assembly. So it's not surprising that the kids are this excited. You look very comfortable sitting here now. Was it always like that? Pretty comfortable because we're not on air yet. But um, yeah, no, it was totally different. I'm pretty relaxed now. The first time I did it was Euro 96 and uh, I was petrified. Great Britain, get the gold medal! He's won an incredible five Olympic golds in five successive Olympics. So tell me about why you're here today. Well, it's all about getting young people involved in sports and all the activities you see today are actually developing the skills levels that they will use in sports in, in years to come. Well, on our way into the hall now to see Fiona, the kids get so excited about assemblies like this and they know that as a teacher because they just don't stop talking about it. This is exactly what the Olympic legacy is all about, giving children like these an opportunity to try a sport that perhaps they wouldn't have chance to normally. It's just brilliant seeing them having such a good time. This is Helen Barnes for East Midlands Today in Nottingham. <laughs> <laughs>